Chakra Gaila, Agus Exmaitu, and Fakshu Arbert, Agus Akhoyu, Higmud Gur Ash, Inta Hawata Hamalarbi, Park Felon or Park Park Sport to be hung. Agus Shin Fakwal Luhar, Agus Ahatagus Broader Nidik, Gur Danik and Vrinmach and Fear, Agus Gul Park Brahavin, a hospital in Shotranona. Kegul and Vem a new cutter at an cell gala. Goal tree, clay, ogun, will get clay a heart because clay a little heart and then fell gala. Ne doyle and gemusha cataract, go part fell gala go home on a missing show. Tayu and Tanyam go kurama go part emera, no part sport avion. When you come, you're going to be in time to have a question of part emera in the carriage. I guess they say yes to win and the plenty that own. Komailish and Felgela, Gemulkuni Ella, Agus Lutlasse, the Gasort, or Shulam, and the Blanty of Haroin. Ladies and gentlemen, I wouldn't like to let this opportunity go by without uh, thanking the following people and the following committees. I'll start off with the trustees, thanking them most sincerely on behalf of the committee for their cooperation down through the years. I had mentioned the GAA Club in Glen, who have facilitated us down through the years in every way by allowing us to run functions or silver circles at their, at their bingo and at other functions. And also to mention that the Glen GAA Club were very responsible or uh, most responsible for the organisation of the games here uh, this evening. I also mentioned the local vocational school particularly the principal, who have always made the facilities there available to the committee down through the years, and particularly so today. I'd mention Jarlath Morris, the manager of the local Eregelesh Chorante, who has supported us down this last 10 or 11 years, and also this last week he has made workers available to us to get the finishing touches to the pitch uh, here this last couple of days. The development committee in Carrick has to get a special word of thanks also because although it's Kushtu Park Emmer in the Carrick uh, that has been directly involved in the work on the field and the development of the field, we certainly could not have done it without the support and uh, the help from the development committee, particularly when some years ago the both committees used to come together to run the carnival in Carrick and the profits from the carnival on more than one occasion was given completely to the sports ground committee and uh, we're very grateful to the development committee for that. have been the biggest single contributor to the, to the field. They have contributed to about 55% of the total cost of the project. A word of thanks also to the immigrants or to the local immigrants abroad throughout the whole world, as Sean said before, but particularly to the local immigrants in Chicago. Some years ago, when we were fairly hard up, hard up for funds, we contacted the Chicago group in Chicago, and they were very prompt in sending us a very substantial sum when indeed it was welcome and badly needed at that particular time. So I'd ask a particular round of applause for those immigrants, please. I hope also that no one will take exception if I single out two people in particular. One is our consultant engineer, Hugh Hoy, who down through the years advised and supervised the work for us. Without him, we obviously wouldn't have the know-how or the advice, and indeed Hugh gave all of his services voluntarily, and we are uh, greatly indebted to him. I think uh, he was here, but he had to leave earlier. So Hugh, good a meal my good at the Pajipurajika Rina Blanthi. The other individual that I'm referring to, of course, is uh, the contractor, the late Fonsi O'Donnell. It's a great day for us here, but it saddens us, of course, that Fonsi is not with us to celebrate the, the obvious success 
of his workmanship and, and his expertise. Binyani Diatrakara or Fonsi. Before I conclude, ladies and gentlemen, obviously there would be no development here. I have mentioned a lot, but there would be absolutely no development without the support of the local people. Since we started collecting funds, it was apparent that there was a great support for a football field here in Carrick. We never met any resistance, or people never complained to, um, to, to contributing to this particular cause. And I think it's here today, is, it's a monument to local community cooperation. And I say hope and pray that it's the first phase in a major development that hopefully down through in, in a few years we'll develop the pitch further and close it, bring it up to inter-county standard, have inter-county Gaelic football matches and athletics and other games as well. So, good meal am I to the local community as well. Without them, uh, we wouldn't have a pitch and I hope that we'll all live to enjoy it in years to come. Good meal am I, a good Okay, hold on. Uh, after her.
enriched by the joy of Christian living. Lord, may this water blessed in your name be a sign of your uh, protection for those who visit here. Protect them from all harm and endow them with a strong sense of sportsmanship, justice and love. May every word and action of theirs give glory to God and honour to Ireland. We ask this through Christ our Lord. And now we we'll finish off by saying, and our Father and Hail Mary for all those people who help to make this field possible, both living and dead. Our now turn you to meet the enemy to get the reaction to the honour and tell them in your name. Should the vow with its land the grace and cheer you at spunny or in the brass and spunny to her the one you eat. Lord, nurse, and wax, and spirit me. Then I'm a large prepared to say anything, but we'll make it very short. And the overall impression I have as I stand here today is that it's a credit to all the people who were involved in the making of this field, their generosity and their expertise deserve our greatest credit and I hope that future generations of young people will remember the prodigious effort that was made to convert a bog into a magnificent playing pitch like this. It is also my hope, as I expressed in the blessing there of the field, that Everybody who plays here will do so with great sportsmanship and never by a word or action will they sully in any way the uh, courtesy, the native courtesy of the Irish people. And also I hope that in years to come when more funds are collected that this pitch will not merely be devoted to football alone but as one of the speakers already said, that it will be available for all kinds of athletics, so that in future German generations, practicing athletics of various kinds, maybe someday, some person from Carrick, in a generation to come, may raise the Irish flag at the Olympics. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I couldn't have done better myself even if I was prepared. Uh, we are very sorry for the slight delay in the proceedings. Uh, Derry were delayed on the road here, but as it is a beautiful evening, I'm sure most of you are quite patient and enjoying the sunshine and the few flying shangans that are down there in the lower end. Uh, I would ask the Kilcar band perhaps to play another tune or two to entertain us. Hopefully Derry will arrive within the next few minutes. Before I go, I would like sincerely to thank those stewards who helped us out on today and those who put in a special effort yesterday in the rain and in the last couple of weeks with a lot of voluntary work that you might or might not have noticed around the field, like lining it out, cultivating the sides, putting up goalpost nets and painting them, etc. I'd like particularly to thank those fellows that manned the gates today and the car parks inside. Koramira Mahargav Kadir. Thank you very much indeed. Sir, <laughs> 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 to Patricia and Patrick, the best of luck. <laughs> the first 50 years at the worst. <laughs>
So we're in our 60s. <laughs> I don't know what you've done with him on Friday night and Saturday night, but he only lasted 30 minutes at the football match on Sunday. <laughs> um, congrat uh, congratulations again, and I hope you have a happy life <laughs> together. <laughs> Hello, Paddock and Trish. Um, even though I'm a few, few days late, I, I just still want to wish you all the very best. And that's it. Bye bye. I hope it is as good as you thought it was going to be anyway. <laughs> good luck in the future. <laughs>